What's good, everybody? Hope everybody's having a beautiful day. Spreading love, loving yourself, and being the best version of yourself. I'm in the car with it today. Look, only the house without my crystals. BBSs can't protect my soul. But I wanted to help y'all with something that a lot of people deal with during in their daily life that is holding them back from opportunities, from happiness, from just doing regular stuff throughout the day, maybe. I want to, if you fear, let me, I'm going to try to put you on a little bit, help you get past that fear. Because when you're living in fear, you're holding yourself back from your full potential. A lot of people have fear because they're either lacking acceptance or they're living in the future or the past. But you got to understand, you can't control what is the way things are going to happen, but you can control how you react to it. Like a lot of people, they have fear from childhood from something that somebody did to them like like spiders or whatever say like you ran into a spider web or you came across a snake or you know what I'm saying 444 by the way I just looked at the clock but you live with that fear and you just hold on to that forever like you have an excuse to hold on to that and you keep telling yourself this is why I fear blah 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 but how long can you keep that an excuse like to hold on to that and plus, as you're holding on to that, you're keeping yourself at a lower point, which is just keeping you from your full potential, which you are trying to get to is your full potential to be your best self. And it's just like you got to learn to get past these things, accept yourself. And most of the time, people get their fears from TV, like television and shit. Television is telling lies to our vision. You got to you got to cut that shit out I don't I try to minimize I minimize my TV and everything like getting on social media and stuff as much as possible because most of the time when you get on social media you just gonna see some negative shit that's gonna either make you feel some type of way or something like that's gonna fuck with your energy and you don't really want that for yourself and TV is just you seeing like a bunch of disasters bunch of wars people like it's showing like just people negative shit bro like people getting hurt and stuff like that but you gotta learn to accept these things ways you can get past your fear is you look like look that shit straight in the eyes bro like overcome that shit understand that you are more powerful and we we are made from stardust we are made from the same fabric as in the universe and the universe does not want you to fear your whole life you can ask yourself that and think about it with your higher self be like did I come here? Did I come here? Is my purpose to fear 24-7? Did I come here to be this way? No, fuck no. You ain't come here to be like that. You came here to be your best self and rise up to greatness. Be your best self. Live free. Live happy. Live in love. We are made from the universe. We are the same as the universe. That's why. And another thing that can help you is saying affirmations i do the affirmations daily and it's helped me along my spiritual journey like I, my spiritual journey is not complete like i'm still of course i'm still in the process but as i've been doing it affirmations has helped me like so 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 much like you could be like i am powerful i am unstoppable i am fear i'm fearless i am greatness i am happiness etc do it do what's best for you do well, bless you, whatever it is that you do. And just live live doing what you love, not live in fear. A lot of people they it's like it's just within their body, like the fear stays within their body and they're allowing it to because they just won't accept themselves or they keep holding on to that fear, which is just bringing you down. Like some people they scared to they scared to look at people like straighten their eyes when they talking. Or just in general that so people are always walking with their head down. But you gotta understand that you are you are you. You are one of one. You came here for a purpose. You are great and you are powerful. You gotta learn to love yourself. Walk with your chest walk with your chest out, walk with your head up. Let people know like yeah, you you happy to be yourself because people can see like a lot of people judge you're not supposed to judge nobody but that's just how people are and you gotta understand that but understand they can't affect you if you love yourself and you know who you are 
Like, no matter what they say, you're not going to give a fuck. Because you know who you are and you love yourself. But people going to see... People can see that, like, your energy. Like, how you carrying yourself. How you taking care of yourself. Like, you could tell, like... For example, at school, you could tell, like, if there's a kid. Like... Like, if somebody's upset or they, like, maybe lack some confidence or something like that. You could tell because they don't really... They really... Not in all situations, but sometimes, like, they stay to themselves. They always be with their head down. And I'm saying not in all situations because I, like, at school, I like to be by myself most of the time. And it's not because I like confidence or nothing. I just want to be to myself sometimes. But not keeping myself away from people. Like, I ask a lot of people how they doing or be like, what's up? You know what I'm saying? But conquer your fear. Take your fear head on. Because, and plus... A lot of people, and another thing, like I said, a lot of people have the fear because they living in the past or in they living in the future. But you gotta, you gotta ground yourself in the present moment. You gotta stop living in the future. People fear that they be like, oh, so what can happen? What's gonna happen? That happened in the past, so I'm waiting for this to happen again. But the fear never comes. That fear that you're fearing it never comes. You're just allowing yourself to stay in that moment so you think that it's going to constantly come, but it's not because you got to, it's not going to come. Fear is just a thought. You got to get rid of that shit, clear that shit out of from your soul and everything, bro. Like fear in the dark, for example, I used to fear the dark and shit like that. Like little shit I used to be scared of, tornadoes or whatever, but I don't fear nothing anymore because I know I'm protected by the universe and so are you. And plus when you like when you keep convincing your mind that you scared of that, your thoughts create your reality. So something in your reality is gonna happen that keeps making you oh like oh shit man, this shit is true, bro. Like I'm blah blah blah, I'm scared of that. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta accept yourself, live in the moment. Like now I just go to sleep in the straight dark. Like I ain't scared of that shit. I'm not scared of natural disasters. I'm not scared of nothing, bruh. Cause fear just holds you back, keeps you from your full potential. Lay yourself on hundred percent. Don't let shit bring you down, cause it's just keeping you from who you are. Take on everything head on, bruh. Fuck what everybody else got to say. Don't live in fear. None of that shit, bruh. Fear nothing. Only accept love and have love within your heart, bro. Because it's a beautiful thing when you accept yourself and love yourself 100%. Don't fear. Don't fear. Clear that shit out from your mind, your soul, your heart. Uplift yourself. Transcend the unconditional love. Be your best self. And another big one. A lot of people, they, uh, they like fear death and shit like that. But you got to know that. We are pure energy. We are pure energy. Energy can never be destroyed. It can only be transferred. So even though, like, maybe we, like, this this body is gone or whatever, your soul and your energy, all that, and it lives on forever. You transcend the unconditional love, happiness, oneness, peace, all that. You create what your mind is. Like, I don't really believe in heaven or hell. Heaven is a mindset. Like, you go to that mindset. Heaven is a mindset, if you get what I'm saying. Like, you picture heaven as a peaceful place, unconditional love, happiness, everything you could, everything you love is there. But I believe it's a mindset, and you transcend to unconditional love and oneness. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it's all your thoughts create your reality. I'm not saying, I'm not going against anybody's religion or nothing. You believe what you believe. Like, whatever makes you happy and sits right with your soul, you do that. But don't let fear hold you back from anything because you may fear something and let opportunity slip you by or be wondering like, man, you're going to be wondering like, man, why did not I do that shit when the time comes? Like, I would have felt so much better if I did and blah, blah, blah. You know what I'm saying? Don't let that shit keep you from opportunities, keep you from happiness, keep you from love, nothing. It's only keeping you at a lower point. Raise up and be your best self. Love yourself. Be the best version of yourself. And just love yourself 100%. I'm not lying. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing because you experience real love. And love is everything. I love y'all. Matter of fact, I love y'all. Have a beautiful day. I hope I can help you. 
in some way. I love y'all.